And hi folks, this is your old pal Uncle Al. And I put out a lot of videos. Check out David Lynn, Prepper Principal. Now he's 110 videos and two shorts. And I think he's still at 532 subs and 477 followers he needs. He did a nice video on the Mountain House Adventure Kit. Check it out, please. Again, I have to tell everybody this. If you have weak stocks and you don't know how to play the stocks and bond market, you should be selling right now. <clears throat> because a lot of you guys don't understand it. This is the time, because my friend Robert told me, that a lot of the weaker, corrupt, and go green stocks are going... Okay, we did warn you, it's the dark recession. February 2023 to June 2024. If your stock is weak or your uh, 401k invested in wrong kind of program, go green, go broke. Okay, uh, let's see. Uh, now we don't need to worry about that. Check out Wayne at the Ungrateful Peasant. He's doing the Waste Lots program. I don't have to worry because Uncle Alan's going the other direction. Okay, nothing is normal anymore. Put Write that down. Trust no one. Every government in the world keeps screaming, you must comply. No. You could shove your green programs up where the sun don't shine. It's a lie. And I keep warning people this. They're coming after your kids. I have to go down a list one to five again, explaining what's going to happen to you. And a lot of people kind of deaf in the ear. Okay, please help. Trapped by stupids in the mental zombie apocalypse. See DMC, RMC, CCP, Magarg, or Gog Hordes. Please send two dollars and seventeen cents donation, and it's right down in the description below. Okay, the main point of this is the weather balloon. It's not a weather balloon; it's an interceptor balloons. They are six of them. They only shot down one. Okay, and if it's not for camera work, it's not for ground observation. It's something else. I keep telling this to people, and they look at me like. I stepped on their dog or cat. All right? It's not for photographic. Okay, you have satellites and you got drones that do a better job. What's a balloon for? Okay, well, yeah, for weather and everything, atmospheric pressure and stuff. For ground radar, leader. And then the other thing, uh, a lot of people don't understand, Wide leader, and that, that's where if you're using a hypersonic missile or subsonic or regular old missile that uses ground radar track to, from air to ground to track its destination. You can't move mountains and stuff. You could do it by satellite, but it's a little hard and you get atmospheric disturbance. So you might be off by 50 to 200 miles. What they're really using for, and I keep telling people, Get this book and read it. All right. There are six factions in China right now. The long marchers do not like Xing. Xing is an idiot. And they said, you know, what the hell are you trying to evade Taiwan? Taiwan is the Ukraine of the East. All right. They try it. You'll have every country, communist, non-communist, go after China. And it'll be a six-way civil war. Their main target, all right, with the balloons, they don't tell you the other five. What's in America? Well, they've been putting up these towers all over the place. And a lot of people look at me, I don't know, Uncle L, are they taking pictures of the ground? And I kind of look at them, and that's the wrong theory that went out in the 1950s. Okay? Plain and simple. 
They've been doing these ads for years, 5G. Now you can't use a satellite to pick up 5G because the Onyx Fair bounce the radio waves and scramble out all the high-tech information. <coughs> okay, plain and simple. They need these balloons, six of them, go across the United States, which is a civilian balloon. All they're doing is getting weather atmospheric data, plus they're getting 5G information. Now, a lot of corporations and a lot of government and our military uses 5G. And they say, well, it's encrypted. <laughs> they don't care. All it does is bounce the signal back to Shanghai. The balloon picks it up. It either goes directly into outer space on a tight band or goes off the ionosphere and heads to Shanghai. Hi, guys. And they get all the information. They're laughing at you. So we shoot a couple weather balloons down. They'll put up a protest and stuff. It's for atmospheric observation. And they have every legal right to do that. But intercepting communication is not. So I hope this answers your question and puts down the rumors. It's not photography. It is not an EMP or CMP device. It's a waste of money. I could do better with a suitcase and a stack of chewing gum. And the biggest EMP, electromagnetic impulse, is the size of a small van. And it has limited range. If I were doing it to a military base, I park three or four U-Hauls around the base and flip a button. Then you're totally useless. Okay, look at Texas. All right, Montana's smart, and they understand what the problem is. Again, there's six factions, and the long marchers are the ones that did the balloon, not Shang. And out of Shanghai again. Hi, guys. Again, they don't want trouble with the United States. The United States is like a fat man eating himself to death in a McDonald's. All right? They just don't have to worry. Now, Xing and his group and the other uh, four factions are fighting over control. And the bad thing is, China, the Hong marchers told them, if you don't get your quality control correct, you'll never win and we'll go into another civil and nuclear war. The long marchers are in for the long march. And they may be dealing with Taiwan a different way. Because they know CCP is like the United States. <clears throat> okay? And a lot of them, they don't want Taiwan to get invaded. And that's a stupid... They want the long term. So they don't want their country ruined by 1950. America, well, it used to be 1940, but... Wait, not 1940. 2040. And America would be... 2076 or 75. Still have to work out the calculation. So I'll catch you later. Do something good for your fellow man. Okay. Invite your neighbor to dinner. Plant a fruit tree. You know, more fruit trees and nut trees you have in the neighborhood, better you are. Uh, people don't think that way. You're in the woods or in the farm. Yeah, all you need is overalls and a banjo, okay? Get to know your people. Get out of the big cities. I keep warning people because modern living is America is. Okay, look at California. Look at my community posts. Uncle Alan's tired. I've been bu always first week of the month. I'm busy as hell, all right? And I've got things i got to do, and we don't have that much time together, folks. And I'll be seeing you. Be good. Do something good for your neighborhood. And if you can afford it, donate a can a month to your local food bank. If everybody does this, America won't go hungry. Now, a lot of people say, America's too fat. Fine. Don't eat for three days. And I'll see you later. I'll be seeing you. Bye now.